All right, you guys have probably heard of something called National Night Out. It happens nationally, right? And of course, here locally. But it's this really cool night where uh, you know law enforcement and first responders they get together with the community. Now, Dewey Beach is kind of doing their own version of this, and we're really excited to tell you more about it. So, to tell you about the Public Safety Day happening in Dewey Beach, we have Lieutenant Cliff Dempsey from the Dewey Police Department. Thank you for being here. You're quite welcome. Happy to have you. Thank you so uh, much. Yeah, of course. So, tell us a little bit about Public Safety Day. What people can expect uh, from this really cool event. Well, it, it really originated um, in the past two years. Mm -hmm. Actually, it's been a little longer than that. We've been really wanting to do the National Night Out. And yeah. of course, Dewey Beach in, in August is a very, very busy time for us. Yeah. And we just could not fit it in our to our schedules yeah. and, and the town schedule. So mm -hmm. we decided to push it off till September. And it, 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 it made it so much easier for us to make this event happen. Definitely. Well, I mean, you can imagine whoever came up with National Night Out didn't think of the beach police, right? You guys are busy in August, a yes. lot of visitors. Yeah. But I love how you don't just not do it all together. You still found a way to connect with the community. Why is that so important for Dewey Police? Well, I mean, it, our community is very small. Mm -hmm. You know, year, the year-round population is very small. Mm -hmm. It's our visitors and our tourists that come in all summer long. And um, it, it grows our population up to, you know, anywhere up to 25,000 people. Yeah. Over the winter, we're usually around four or 500. So that's our target our audience is our local community. Um, you know, now that people are traveling home and the weekends are still busy, there's yeah. people coming in on the weekends, but you know, our target is the, the children in the local school districts that live and interact with us. Fantastic, yeah. so tell us what we can expect at the event. It's on the 21st, so yes. it's coming up pretty soon. Uh, what are people gonna see? What are they gonna be able to do there? So. What the public's going to see is they're going to see an interaction between police, fire, the United States Coast Guard, mm -hmm. the um, the National Guard will be in attendance. Um, we have a couple local companies that are going to set up booths. We're going to have a lot of activities for the kids. Um, they're going to have a bounce house, uh, petting zoo. Mm -hmm. They're uh, we're going to do some face painting. Um, also, we'll have the Bookmobile Cape and Lopins nice. partner with us. Um, the school district they've been wonderful. Um, and then several demonstrations. We're gonna have a canine demonstration. The fire department's gonna do a, um, a mock extrication from a car, so they're gonna cut a car apart. Ooh. They're gonna do a controlled fire um, on the ground, and the fire department's gonna put that out. So we just want the children, even adults, to see what equipment we have, how we use it, and how we work together as police, fire, and EMS. And I did forget, the, um, the Rehoboth Beach um, Ambulance Service will be there, mm -hmm. and Sussex County EMS. This is so cool that you have different uh, groups too, from different cities, different towns, different first responders. Why is that so important for you guys to show? Not just Dewey Beach Police, because I'm sure you could show off all day, but you have other groups coming. It's no secret. You drive through Dewey Beach on a busy summer mm -hmm. weekend, you will see cars from Milford. You will see cars, mm -hmm. police cars from Milton, um, Ocean View, uh, South Bethany. So we, we consistently work together. We always help each other out. And this is just a good time for everybody to get together and have a good day. This is going to be awesome. So tell us about how people can get involved. If they need to sign up ahead of time and then you know when and where this event is taking place yeah there's no registration it's okay. it's completely free it is going to be uh this saturday at um at noon till four mm -hmm. um you just show up and have a good time we we're okay. really excited to see the community i love that easy fun and i heard there could be some free food involved so just saying if you that, that entices you it entices me a good bit uh well thank you so much for being here today and telling us all about this this is really important and i think the community is going to love hanging out with all of you and we will love to hang out with the community perfect all right you guys so. don't forget about that this uh this saturday you said noon to four noon to four yes. all right i hope you got it well thank you again for being here and uh, have so much fun this weekend if you're going take lots of photos take the family perfect family fun event uh but coming up we have some jokes for you that'll be fun as well stay tuned